channel I am cute little voice today I do have another unit to show you guys so this wig analysis will be on another braided unit and I have maybe uh, five or six more to show you guys um, because I've been really feeling my braided units lately um, for the fall winter and the summer coming up and if you didn't know braided units are not um, being made as much and they're selling out like crazy so when I'm bringing these to you guys make sure you pick them up as soon as possible so um, before I get started on this unit let me just tell you that this unit is on sale right now this beautiful unit it is a dupe for um, the expressions uh, by all trade box spray unit the large unit um, the large box spray I should say and this unit is on sale for $14.99. Yes, $14.99 for this gorgeous, gorgeous unit. Now, I've already reviewed this unit and like an ombre color, and this is also an ombre color. Um, let's talk about this unit. This is from the brand Vanessa. This is Cynical Braid Top Slace uh, Wig Braids Shop Styles, and this is Tops Boxy Braid 2, and I have it in a color ombre red. So, yeah, that is the unit. I also have... Uh, a color just like that one so if you you like that color make sure you pick it up again I am going to say that the wig on the model is deceiving so um, when you get this wig do not expect that humped up wiggy look um, it looks nothing like that in person so that's a great thing okay so um, let's talk about this unit Okay, so I was really scared to uh, try this unit because it is a fire red color, especially at the tips. As I showed you in the previous clip, um, the, the tips are a fiery red and they do come as um, straight ends that are like uh, wefted uh, together at the end. Um, so... Yeah, I would say I don't know how that's going to look because I'm used to my burgundy. So the color is absolutely gorgeous. You are getting uh, an ombre, which is a burgundy up top, and then it has straight, uh, excuse me, streaks of uh, black in the unit, and then it goes down to a fiery red color. Um, so it does come with baby hairs as well. These are the baby hairs. I just gelled them down or got to be glued them down and they're really cute. Now the baby hairs are not black. They are red, which is cute. So I know a lot of you cuties like to do your eyebrows up and make them red as well. So that'd be cute. A little nice touch to add to this unit. Um, as far as the um, cap construction, this is a medium to large head cap. It does come with four colors combs one two three one in the back with the adjustable straps um so it does come with parting um here is the part i did add some concealer um actually uh, press powder don't add liquid concealer because it will get messy it will get all over the braids make sure you go ahead and add some um Press powder is cracked up here, but get some press powder, whatever you want to get. But make sure you get press powder so that your unit doesn't um, have all that liquid foundation on it. So, and then the powder is easy, you know, easy to wipe off. So, yes, here is the parting space on the unit. Um, it's a lot of parting space right in the front area so you can do quite a few different styles with this unit and I'll show you that um, 
I'll show you those styles that I do with this unit at the end of this video. So make sure you stay tuned for those styles and just in case you want to get this unit and style it up to your liking. Okay, so um, the box braids are pretty full. It's not like... Let me say, yeah, I was about to say it's really a medium density, but it's really not. It's actually um, a full density. This is all of the braids to the front, and um, it's quite a lot of hair, and you're not getting any filler hairs in the back. So as you can see, um, I'm going to show you from the back how I have it all to the front. You can wear it like this, and... Um, you don't have to expect any uh, filler hairs or any gaps to show. Um, you're not getting any gaps or filler hairs with this unit. Now, what I can tell you to make the unit look a little bit more natural, um, you can, you know, when you cut the lace, it is a harder lace, but it's not really irritating to me. But if it is to you, you might want to just use your wig grip. But you, you just want to put a little powder around the lace. Um, to make it look more like scalpish uh, parting. So don't um, leave it white because the uh, lace is white, a whitish color. So make sure you put a little powder around the ends and it will just blend into the extra parting that they do give you. Um, so yeah, that's mainly it. No shedding, no tangling. Now this unit here, any unit basically... Um, a braided unit will last you some years. I had I have had um, my box box braid units for years. Okay, like going on two years, I've had my um, uh, expressions box braid unit, and it's really holding up. Now, the only thing I can say that the box braids do get a little frizzy, um, and you do get like little flyaways that come out of the brace. But all you have to do with that is snip them away with some scissors, and you'll be good to go. Add a little uh, wig shine to like shine the wigs back up, and you should be fine. So yes, um, let me stop babbling on <laughs> and um let me show you some styles ladies hopefully you can use these styles and you know just jazz it up um i'm going to put some charms on it and everything like that and then you know you can just see what i'm going to do and uh the, you can get the charms from your local beauty supply store for about 99 cent or anything like that so not too expensive at all so let's get started i'll see you soon Thank you.